Dr Christian Ingwerda from the Queensland Medical Research Institute has won the grant under the Australia-India Strategic Research Fund. The disease they're tackling is visceral leishmaniasis, also known as black fever. Half a million people every year um, develop disease and we estimate there's somewhere about 50,000 deaths each year, each year from the disease as well, the majority of which occur in um, India, uh, the Sudan uh, and, and Nepal, Bangladesh, around that area. The research is into why the body's immune system does not always fully fight the disease. I said in about 9 out of 10 individuals we can then control parasite growth, but about 10% of people that get infected go on to develop clinical disease. Black fever is spread by sand flies, which often breed in the mud brick homes where the victims live. The counterpart Indian funding is going to an Indian professor. Professor Sundar, he has a, a clinic in, in, a, in a town called Mazafapur in Bihar, uh, where he treats uh, VL patients. They treat anywhere between 1,500 and 2,000 patients each year. Dr Ngwerda says the research is promising. So we've identified a few key molecules that suppress the immune response. And what we'd like to try and do is block those molecules and see if we can enhance uh, our own body's um, antiparasitic immune response to better control infection. And that may have wider implications. So for example, diseases like HIV or tuberculosis or even um, chronic um, diseases like some of the cancers, we believe similar uh, immune suppressive mechanisms are in place. So we think that some of the findings we make in our studies here might have broader application. Under the grant, scientists from India will come to Queensland to work in these laboratories. Sean Dorney, ABC News, Brisbane.